I'm the bad boy Joey Janela, and I want you to subscribe to SME Wrestling. They're on the road to 1K. Thank you so much, 1,000. Yeah. yeah, you heard the bad boy Joey Janela. Subscribe. Road to 1K, boys. Hello everyone, I'm Kim McDonald, the only commentator for this company, and welcome back to S Wrestling YouTube Brawl, where today it's the show after Revenge. Revenge was a really great pay view. We have two, or maybe like, all the great matches, well especially that ending of his Jacksepticeye, and that Fatal 4 for the European Championship, those were freaking bangers. And that new side to Bendy, apparently he was still has that crazy ink to him, but like, uh, he's still the dancing dude, but he's making angry. He goes into the crazy ink demon. And uh, yeah, but right now, also at the main event, after Bradley lost to Lewis and couldn't play in the SB Championship, Bradley has decided to betray his own brother, Jason Blay. Like, why would you, why would you do it to your own brother? I'm very speechless. And right now, the father of the Blade family, Baron Blade, is in the ring, and he's going to try to explain this situation here. Okay, everyone, listen. I am more disappointed than you are. I do need some explaining to do here. What I saw was disgusting. It was absolutely despicable. And I did not expect this to happen. So I need to clear things up here. First, I need Jason Blade come out here. I need to have a talk with my sons here. I need Jason Blade coming out here. And I want Bradley Blade out here too. Baron Blade calling out his brothers here. Means like his son. Here comes. Uh, we're going to explain to that twat Bradley Blade. Wait, no, it's, it's just Jason, the good brother. Jason's coming here, but no Bradley. Maybe because he doesn't like being here anymore. Jason, it's just you. Where's Bradley? I don't know where the fuck he is. He's a fucking bitch. What the... F okay, Jason, look, I know. I am very upset, just like you. Listen, I have no idea what just happened. I have no idea what was going on in Bradley Blaze's head. But he was clearly focused on becoming SME champion. It was his big opportunity here. And he lost it. And he started, decided to take all his frustrations out on you. Yeah, I can't believe what he just done. Like, he's my younger brother, man. I was supporting him. We still love him. But after he done that to me, like, I don't know what the fuck just happened, Baron. I don't know what the fuck just happened, Dad. Yeah, listen, hopefully, Brad Blaze, soon enough, if he's watching this, hopefully he comes out and apologizes to you. Yeah, he fucking better. What he did was absolutely despicable. What he did to me was just gut-wrenching to me. Bradley Blade, wherever you are, I want you to come here and say face-to-face, -face, Oh, look, here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, wait, there is the twat, Bradley. Yeah? What do you want from me, Jason? Listen, what the fuck did you do to me, huh? What do you mean why I did it? Wait, don't act like you didn't do it. You fucking attacked me after the match of revenge. Huh? You should never fucking do that to me. You should- Hey, what the hell? A lot of blood by Baron Blade, what the fuck? What the hell is this? Was Baron Blade all in on it now? Was he in it all along? No, oh, come on. Fatal Blade struck that Jason. What the fuck is this now? Baron just betrayed. His oldest son, for his youngest son, what the fuck is this now? What the fuck? I don't believe this shit. This is fucking bull. Can't believe Baron just betrayed his, like, you know, oldest son to go with his younger brother, his younger son, Bradley Blake. What the hell's going on here? Jason's all alone now. What the fuck is Baron up to? What was he like all along with Bradley Blade here? Just Jesus Christ. The Blade family is just falling apart here. And these two despicable men. Well, not these two right now, but like the two despicable men, the father and son, Bradley and Baron. Jesus Christ. Anyway, since I'm too like razzed up about, you know, that situation to the Blade family, I forgot to talk about today's match. It is Etelad. Versus lit versus Dad City. 
Yeah, it's, it's, Will Fletcher is very, very intrigued to be here tonight with uh, Elliot here because you know that's you know, Lil Flash is that city's son, and uh, yeah, this is kind of a little bit awkward here, but um, yes, but Lil Flash of course you know portrayed that city, and now he's with Elliot, and it looks like Elliot is coming out here. He's got and Lil Flash is hoping Elliot beats the hell of that city. This is for that city's first match since you know, Coming back to WrestleMania and have his first match back in like May and then get cursed up by uh, Joe Anthony. And now let's see Dad City again. There we go. I haven't seen him in a little bit of a while. I haven't seen him in like two months. Here comes Dad City. Got right here finally back here. It's gonna be a little bit awkward and personal that no not his son is there on ringside for Airled. But that's he's gonna try to mostly focus onto Etelet here. And yeah, Lil Flash, of course, lost to Edge in the Kick Shot of Revenge here. And now Animal Assault will ruin Dad City. His father is gonna try and defeat Etelet as we get the match started now. Our right, matchup has begun. And look at Dad City. Oh, Dad City. Oh, what a nice counter right there. Dad City already after a running start. Hits Bullard right in front of Lil Flash just to insult him. It just, like, you know, adds salt to the wound. After a little flash lost to Edge, Judgment Day Edge should say. Ella tried to interfere, but that little freaking girl, that creepy girl, had to come and interfere. But it's Ella just striking down that city again. Now I thought that little Ella's gonna wait for that city to uh, get back in the ring, but now he's gonna go straight after him. Oh no, and he's gonna use the the hardest mat, the mat, the mat on the outside of the ring, the concrete mat, to add some damage. He's going for a suplex. Whoa, but that city can that a big nasty jab there. It's got a headlock here. It's got a little, little nasty, nasty headlock on the outside. Of course, there's no like headlock takeover on like inside the ring, and there's a, there's a can of course. Need to get back in the ring soon enough. And that's he's going for another headlock takeover. He's trying to like stall for outside the ring. He's getting very dangerously close to a can out here on the cow six. And the cow seven. Then that's he put Elliot back in the ring here. There you go, back in the ring is Elliot and Dad City. Mostly spent a lot of time outside. Oh no, and that little flash. He's distracting Dad City to give Ella the advantage here. Of course, that, that's what a little flash thing could do. That's what that's a little, definitely a little flash thing to do. And of course, little flash puts a chair in the ring. I don't think referee saw it. Yeah, oh, I think now he saw Oh no. And now Ella has an advantage. So he's just, uh, little Flash trying to distract the wrestler. Elliot can use the chair, but Dad City merely fights back. Hits a close onto Elliot here. Oh, Jesus Christ. Boom! Oh, my God. What a power slam. Elliot, the Freakazoid, just roaring after that successful takedown and delivering them elbows onto Dad City's shoulders. This is not a good way. Dad City's pushed the underdog here against the Freakazoid. And, of course, F doing the good things, putting the chair back in the ring. Meanwhile, Elliot just stomps down. Onto Dad City, right in his goddamn chest. So he's gonna keep stopping him down. Make sure he does not get up here. Okay, this is what this is what the little freak is gonna do. Just beat the hell out of his opponent here. Club and strikes and stomps and shit. Dad City just getting absolutely winded here. Now what's the other one do now? Just slowly pick it up. Oh god, and once again, he's gonna keep punching the face of Dad City. He's gonna continue mauling this man. He's gonna keep on mauling Dad City until he goes for some ball drug of side effect. But Dad City avoids it. Oh my god, big clothesline. Big nasty clothesline by Dad City. And Dad City's gone for a little trick. Camel clutch. He gets, and he's going to pick up Little Flash again here. Oh, Olympic slam. Big Olympic slam by Dad City. Dad City's trying to do everything he can to take out LED. Oh, here comes the Daddy Shuffle. Haven't seen that move in a while. The Daddy Shuffle goes for the cover already. Oh wait, no, Lil Flash, he's distracting the ref. Typical Lil Flash. To avoid Datsy from getting the pin. Jesus Christ. Datsy would have won that match with the Daddy Shuffle. Oh, but now he's going to distract Dad City again here. Lil Flash wants to keep on getting involved. Look out for Elliot. Oh, Jesus Christ. Full Nelson. Jesus Christ. And oh no, now Elliot, he's come for his submission finish. He's calling for choke out. Oh god, he's gone for the choke out. Whoa, no, Dati breaks free. He breaks from the choke. A big punch. Oh, no, but Ellis fight, fights back. Oh, but it's a nice reversal by Dati again. Now, Dati slow pick up Ellis. Oh, but Ellis sweeps him down. 
Sweet and Dad is going to tell you to stop him. Dad can tell you to stop him to hell at Dad City. But here comes Dad City with a shoulder tackle right there. Dad City really needs to call for a finish here. He's slowly dragging away LA. Going for the cover. But this time LA is not distracting the ref. I mean, no flash is not distracting the ref. So that, of course, he's known as a basic move and LA might easily kick out. LA Dad City just taunting right now. He's trying to feel it here. And he's slowly picking up Etelade. He's trying to pick up for. Well, Te oh, trying to lock up, but Ella just pushes him down. Oh my god! It's a vicious lariat by Etelade right there. Just taking out Dad C. Now he goes for cover with these shoulders down. Only a one count there. And Ella can't believe it. Before you'd be done with this, for an easy one and done with Dad City to make Little Flash proud and beat the hell of Little Flash's father. But now he stays he's going for more. Dragon with belly to Oh my god! Dad C getting desperate. Hitting the iron rank. Onto Ellen, going for the cover after the DDT here. Is that enough? Only a two count. For, oh, Ellen, oh, Ellen knows what's happening here. Dude, Ellen's about to get hit with the elbow drop, but Dad Z. Oh, fucking hell! He managed to hit the elbow drop. Where does Lil Flash? Lil Flash is right there just staring at his fight. He can't do anything because otherwise he'll get himself to score fight. Dad Z can go, go for the pin right here. He has a little Ellen right where he was. Oh, no, little Flash. Don't you fucking dare. Don't you fucking dare, little Flash. Here it comes. Dad C. Go for Oh, sick one. No, Ellen moves out the way. He moves, rolls out the way right there. Now, Ellen, he's grabbing a hold of Dad City again. And was going to put him on the ropes. What was going to do? Ah, oh, big nasty strike. And no, no, Dad C. With the counter right there. And there's a decking DDT. And this time with the cover. Is that enough? This could be enough to take out Ellen. Right here. Oh, my God. Still a two count. It's still only a two. And Dad C. He's going to do something. He's going for a nasty head crank. Dread God, no, I don't have Tyrone anymore to tell, say the T word. Head T. You, you, if you know, you know. And that's it. He's probably going to try again here. What is he going to call for now? Is he calling for... Oh, here he comes. That's time. The elbow connects. He connects. Yeah, this could be enough to end off LN right here. Oh, that's it. That City gets the victory right there. Oh, Lil Flash is not happy. Wait, Lil Flash get in the ring. Oh, come on. The sore loser, Lil Flash, is just beating up his own father. All because Ella lost. Keep going. Got Lil Flash, oh boy. Just beating the hell of Dad C right now here. Oh, hang on a minute. What the fuck? Heal police! Red alert! Oh my gosh, the heal police again. Lil Flash, you're on a most wanted list. What the fuck? It's two weeks of jury for you. Oh god, Lil Flash got caught by the heal police. Ah! Well, I have no idea what's going on here. We need to make an explanation on that heel police, where the fuck he came from. Oh shit, well, Dad City, he tosses Ellen out of the ring. <laughs> well, sayonara, gang of domination. Well, I am back now. I have no Joe Anthony current kind of stop ahead, and I, I'm going to be all free now. I'm hopefully going to wrestle a lot more here, and that's me wrestling. And you know what? Since I am now kind of a singles competitor now, I think I should go after a singles championship. Okay, Dad C wants to go after the singles championship. And how about that? I want to go after the IC championship. The IC championship. Does that championship belong to Chris Jericho here? Oh, wait a minute. Speaking of the IC champion, asking you shall receive. It's the, the demo god, Le Champion, the face of fear, Chris Jericho. Sorry, he's staring at Dad City now. Dad City! You really dare to challenge Le Champion to a match for my Intercontinental Championship. Yeah, and you know, the next pair of you is called Money in the Bank. And I feel like a lot of money, money, money. And I'm gonna feel like the richest man in the world once I have a gold championship around my waist. This ain't even gold, it's white. Whatever, it's still a piece of gold. It's still a championship here. And I want to face you for the IC championship at Money in the Bank. You know what? Fuck it, why not? I need some challengers for my Intercontinental Championship. And I need some worthy opponents. And you, you may not look like a worthy opponent, but I see what you do in the ring as pretty talented. So I might as well... Accept the challenge for Money in the Bank. Okay, because I just made official with Shadow. Alright, cool. 
And, uh, you know how you said, like, oh, Santana Ortiz were not banned from ringside? Are they still not banned from wrestling? Nope, they're banned from ringside this time. And it the inner circle pals. Oh, you jackass! Yep, so enjoy being, trying to feed all by yourself here. <laughs> Dad City, make an agreement with Chris Jericho. Make an agreement with Shadow to make the match official, but with the inner circle banned from ringside. For real this time. No Santana Ortiz can be unbanned from ringside. That's our first match for Money in the Bank. Dad City versus... Chris Jericho for the Intercontinental Championship. That's the end of this episode of YouTube Blog. We'll see you guys next time.